through my practice, I love to think of new ways to tell story through art, whether that's a three metre glass eel trap or a 3D printed kangaroo tooth necklace. Everything is based on traditional practice. Ritual and ceremony is made up of 84 men and women representing the language groups of Victoria. When I made the initial 38 Aboriginal women, I had to get permission off elders to actually make that work. I also got permission off Lachi elders to have the historical Kopi mourning caps in my exhibition at the Melbourne Museum. Then for the next iteration of the exhibition, I worked with 45, 46 Aboriginal men and got their stories of lost sorrow and mourning. But I also designed seven t-shirts to represent the scars that the men would have worn during different rituals and ceremonies. The projections that are going to be on the building at the NGV during my exhibition will be a mixture of both the men and women in mourning and they will have the mourning marking across their eyes, the men will wear the t-shirts and the women will be dressed in long black dresses which is basically our, our mourning practice today. So yeah, when people are driving down Russell Street and they see ritual and ceremony on the side of the building, they will see that Aboriginal people are still here, have survived into the 21st century and hopefully come into the NGV and learn a little bit more about Aboriginal culture and practices.